NBC is back with two amazing comedies, Truth Be Told and Undateable, and I just talked to the cast of both shows. You've got to stay tuned for the exclusive interviews. Thank you. Hey everyone, it's your host Stacey Eck, and I'm here at the Paley Center with Miss Bianca, who plays lovely on Undateable. How are we? I am fabulous. How are you? Haircut's on fleek. You see the haircut? <laughs> I'm really loving this haircut. Oh, life. thank you. Some people are into it, some people hate it. So Who hates it? Just some people. People on the, Not people that we should talk about? No. That are not well, relevant not at all? give them the time of day. Exactly. You know, you gotta change it up sometimes. Actually, you gotta block them. That's what I would do. Yeah. But anyway. <laughs> That's another story. Yes. I am loving you on this show. You're amazing. Oh, We're going into season you. three. This is wonderful. Um, I want to have a quick talk about Magnolia because I was driving on that street today and I was like, oh my God, I have to talk to Bianca about oh this. God. So I know that um, she was named after your husband's favorite movie. What's your favorite movie? Oh my gosh, uh, you guys, I'm so going to date myself and, and actually be so cheesy right now, but my favorite movie of all time is Lady Hawk with Michelle Pfeiffer and Rucker Howard. But those are classic. It was a classic. It was classic 80s, the great 80s music. You can't mess with it. Um, and I like love anything with like a mystical aspect, like the love story of the man that can't have the woman and you know all that. Oh my god. So how has being a mom changed you in terms of your role? Has that changed at all? Uh, just in terms of my role at work, it's uh -huh. definitely made me more focused to be at work when I'm at work so that I can like leave it when I right. come home and just right. be with her. Um, and I, you know, honestly, I feel like it's helped me be a little bit more silly and playful and realize like everything else is cake Thank compared you. to raising your kid. <laughs> right. I love that. Yeah. I love that. Um, so what about if Magnolia said, hey mom, I want to be an actress. Any reservations? Uh, not really. I feel like anything you do these days is difficult and there's challenge and people are out there trying to do jobs that, if she gets to do something that she loves to do for a living, I'm so excited yeah. for her. Yeah. I love it. And I know you mentioned that your husband cooks more than you. Has yeah. that changed at all? Oh, no. <laughs> well, except he's starting to work a lot more now and so I just make him come home in between gigs. And I'm like, you got to cook for the next couple Couple days you and we'll store right it. I, I did. Like, He's amazing. Right I love it. I love it. <laughs> so on Dateable this season, what's a one way that I guess it's it's crazy because it's going to be live. Yeah. All you know, all season long. Yeah. Is that scary for you? Is it amazing? Excited? It's pretty amazing. I mean, I think at first I was kind of like, whoa, we're doing every single one. But now that I've heard kind of the plans and the fact that it's going to be like a party every Friday night, we're going to have bands coming in. It's just it it really spices up something that I've been doing for a long time. It makes it new and fresh, and uh, I'm totally excited about it now. Totally down. One word to describe Undateable Season 3. Uh, ah! <laughs> that, that, that. Congratulations. Thank you so much. So much. Oh, nice to meet you, too. You're beautiful. So as you can see, the fall is going to be funny. So make sure to stay tuned on Black Hollywood Live for more exclusive interviews. You can check me out on Twitter and Instagram at One Take Stace. And thank you so much for watching.